guys, I'm John. Today we're here at the Mishimoto Garage to install the Mishimoto Performance Air Intake on our 2015 Ford Mustang EcoBoost. If you haven't done so already, subscribe to our YouTube channel for more information on the Mustang EcoBoost. While you have the stock air box off, it's a great idea to install the Mishimoto Baffled Oil Catch Can. Let's get started on the install. Tools needed for install include 8mm socket, 10mm socket, 10mm deep socket, 4mm Allen key, 3 8 drive 6 inch extension, 3 8 drive ratchet, 10mm ratchet wrench, flathead screwdriver, and channel lock pliers. Install time is about 30 minutes, and install difficulty is a 2 out of 5. Using a flathead screwdriver, loosen the worm gear clamp connecting the intake box to the rubber intake boot. Remove the intake boot from the air box. Disconnect the plug from the air intake temperature sensor. Remove the tree clip holding the wire harness on the side of the air box. You can either pull it out by hand or use pliers. Remove the one 10 millimeter bolt holding the air box to the inner wheel well. You can remove the entire air box assembly by pulling it towards the rear of your Mustang, then upward. With the air box assembly now out of your engine bay, remove the air intake temperature sensor from the air box by twisting the sensor counterclockwise. Using channel lock pliers, remove the spring clip from the bypass valve hose. Next, remove the bypass valve hose from the intake pipe. Remove the quick disconnect fitting from the hose next to the bypass valve. Pull outward on the plastic tab before pulling on the connector itself. Using your flathead screwdriver, loosen the worm gear clamp connecting the intake tube to the turbo inlet. Remove the intake tube assembly by pulling towards the front of your Mustang and then slightly twisting the assembly to clear the side of the engine. Attach the provided T-bolt clamp to the Mishimoto silicone inlet hose and connect the hose to the turbo. Make sure that the clamp is facing in the direction shown. A small amount of WD-40 inside the silicone hose will aid with the installation. Do not fully tighten the T-bolt clamp yet. Reconnect the quick disconnect fitting. You should hear the plastic tab snap into place. Reconnect the bypass valve hose to the CNC machined fitting on the silicone inlet hose and slide the spring clip into place using channel lock pliers. Remove the one long 10 millimeter bolt that secures the headlight housing. Using a flathead screwdriver, remove the two tree clips from the harness on the bottom of the inner wheel well. Loosen the one eight millimeter top ground bolt, but do not fully remove it. Apply the thin rubber strip to the airbox opening. Press firmly to ensure that the strip attaches to the sheet metal. Now you can install the airbox. If needed, pull slightly upward on the plastic diversion plate. Ensure that the tab on the airbox falls in line with the ground bolt. Fully tighten the 8mm ground bolt so that the tab is secured. Install the two tree clips on the bottom, starting with the rearward tree clip. Reinstall the long 10mm bolt through the forward tab on the airbox and then fully tighten. Attach the Mishimoto air filter to the aluminum intake pipe. Use a flathead screwdriver to tighten the filter onto the pipe. Using your 10 mm ratchet wrench, attach the upper bushing to the intake pipe. The unused threads must face upward as that end attaches to your Mustang. Reinstall the air intake temperature sensor by pushing the sensor onto the opening and turning clockwise until the sensor stops. Attach the large worm gear clamp to the silicone hose. Ensure that the bolt head faces towards the side of the engine for easy tightening. Remove the tree clip holding the wire harness to the body of your Mustang. This allows for some extra slack in the harness. Insert the intake pipe and filter into your engine bay. If the filter fitment is a little tight, turn the assembly slightly during installation. Next, position the rubber bushings so that the threads protrude through the opening in the body. Install a 10 millimeter nut and hand tighten. Position the intake pipe into the silicone inlet hose. The hose should have some room to move. Fully tighten the large worm gear clamp using a flathead screwdriver. Using a 10 millimeter socket, fully tighten the T-bolt clamp that holds the silicone inlet hose to the turbo. Next, go ahead and fully tighten the 10 millimeter nut that holds the rubber bushing to the body of your Mustang. Route the wire harness around the pipe and through the small cutout near the corner. Attach the tree clip to the opening in the Mishimoto airbox. Route the wire plug outside the airbox and connect it to the temperature sensor. Attach the larger rubber strip to the airbox lid. 
the rubber strip must sit flush on one end and extend about three quarters of an inch on the other end for clearance. Insert the airbox lid. Press firmly to ensure that the rubber strip attaches to the sheet metal. Now we want to attach the airbox lid to the airbox. Use the three supplied 4mm black button head bolts and nylon washers included in your kit. Now that you've installed your brand new Mishimoto Performance Air Intake, double check to make sure that all your connections are tight and take your Mustang for a test drive. After this install, click subscribe.